how to make a simple room with a start position. Okay, at first we want to make a box. Good. A little bit higher. So, now let's browse for a texture. I like the concrete textures. <coughs> And this is for the game team fortress. Let's choose this and press enter. You got that. But that looks crap. This red stripe here in the middle doesn't look very good. So go to the to the texture application. And now you can make it better. Click on the T button and it goes down. Okay. Now we got that. Now let's work at the room. When we go inside there is nothing. So we want to make a hollow. You go to tools, make hollow. I want to make it minus two and press OK. Oh good. There we go. Now we can choose it again better good but the floor doesn't look very good so click here in the room and now press control and U to ungroup this box now you can choose several different uh, floors or walls good to select more than one, click on one and hold control and press next. You selected both and now you can go to browse and for example computer wall this and you would click on the Apply current texture tool and we got a nice floor and here. Okay. So you got your first room and we now want to make a start position on the click on the entity tool and make a new entity. But attention the the entity mm, don't let it stand on the ground because it will get stuck. It doesn't work when it's uh, here stands on the ground. Okay, you got it. Now you can play the map. Go to file, save as. Test. Okay, save. Then you can press F9 and compile it. And then you can run the map. Okay, thank you for watching. This was only a basic first room tutorial. Extremely simple. I only wanted to show how to make a start position and how to uh, make the hollow uh, and how to use the hollow tool. Yes. <laughs> Thank you for watching. This is all from me now. Fasten to solve. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and watch my other videos. <coughs> Goodbye.